is Savvy Joe Scarecrow. We're going to have a great time together. What's your name? My name is Zoe. And my name is Justin. I wonder what all of your names are. On the count of three, why don't you all shout out your names nice and loud so I can hear them all the way up here. Ready? One, two, three. Would you like me to tell you the story of the Great Big Boo? Yeah. Yes? Well, it all happened one very spooky evening. All the kids in the neighborhood were getting ready to trick or treat. Some were scary and some were sweet. There's something spooky on Halloween night. Grab your costume, grab your bag, take your flashlight and your mask. We're hoping for some yummy treats tonight. Meet your friends out on the street. We're going to yell out, trick or treat. Everyone, it's Halloween night. Mommy's ghosts and superheroes, just a few you'll meet. You better be quick on your feet. Looks like they're ready for Halloween. Go knock on that door and let's start trick or treating. Who's there? I'm Zoe, and that's my older brother Justin. Trick or treat! What? You aren't trick or treating in Boo Alley, are you? Yes, and you should come trick or treating too. That's a great costume. This is no costume. I'm Vinny the Vampire. Cool, a real vampire. Well, it depends who you ask. You see, I'm very afraid of the dark. How do you do it? Well, if it gets too dark, I just turn on my flashlight. Because I'm a little scared of the dark, too. Hey, everyone, if you've got a flashlight, Turn it on. Let's show Vinny we're not afraid of the dark. Why, this changes everything. With one of these fancy flashlights, I can find my way in the dark. Don't be afraid if you think it's too dark. Throw on the switch. It gives us the spot. Flashlights, flashlights. Light up the night with your flashlights, flashlights. got a flashlight, a flashlight, a shiny white beacon of beautiful light. I was scared before, but now I'm all right because of my beautiful flashlight. Welcome, Vinny. I'm glad we could help. Now you can come trick-or-treating with us. Oh, no! You must not go trick-or-treating in Boo Alley. Why not? Wendella the Witch. That's why not. She won't let anyone trick-or-treat. <laughs> Ready for 
the fun. I, Wendell the witch, and I say there will be none. Not a nibble. How much? Less than that. Treating here is a very good idea. We're not going to let some old witch ruin our Halloween. We're going to go trick or treating. Come on, Zoe. Some call me a bad scientist, but I'm actually quite friendly, yes. Hello, Cranium. My name is Zoe, and this is my big brother, Justin. And we're here trick-or-treating with all our friends on Boo Alley. Well, that's not likely, unless you like living on a lily pad. <laughs> Ribbit. Cranium, why does Wendella hate Halloween? Every Halloween, Boo Alley would celebrate with a big party. Everyone in Boo Alley could dance, but when it was Wendella's turn, oh my, oh, she couldn't dance at all. Oh, very clumsy. Yes. Everyone made terrible fun of her, and she felt very sad. And when she was old enough and powerful enough, she moved to the house up at the top of the hill and cursed everyone. Ever since, there's been no trick-or-treating in Boo Alley. Man, that's terrible. How can we help Wendella and save Halloween? I'm a master of potions and drinks, and while I've ruined a couple of sinks, I'm so very close to creating the dose that will remove Wendella's jinx. But I'm one ingredient shy, and I don't know which one or why, but something is missing, and without it we're kissing a Halloween fun goodbye. Bye -bye.
some Halloween candy. Cut it! Cat whiskers? Check! A slimy slug? Yep, it's all in there. I thought for sure this would be the potion to bring Wendella back to love Halloween. Did you try to scare it? Boom! Oh, you've just given me an idea. Justin, come with me. So we try and find all your new friends in Boo Alley. We might need some help. Be a 